today we'll be making an origami seal. So we're starting with a square sheet of paper. We're going to fold from the top left down to the bottom right corner. And we'll create a crease. And then we'll open that back up. Now we'll bring our top edge along the center line. Now the right edge to the center line. And we'll open both of those back on. Now the left edge into the center line. Take your time with these videos, pause along the way if you'd like, and the bottom edge into the center line. It's important to get the first folds of any origami project accurate, as if they're off, it will throw the whole project off. Okay, we can now open those two folds as well. We'll now rotate our project slightly just into a diamond shape. We'll work firstly on the left hand side. We'll start bringing this edge into the center line. Only partly though, because we'll then bring this edge also into the center line. As we do that, we'll just walk our fingers towards the middle As we keep doing that, we left a little bit in the center. So we should just have a small flat left. Then we'll do the same for the right hand side. Firstly, bringing this edge here towards the center. And then the bottom right edge also towards the center. Slowly move our fingers towards the middle, leaving us with that flap. Put that great little crease on. So now I've got a little flap on each side. So next we'll pick our model up. We're just going to be folding it in half. So maybe if we turn it this way, give you a better look. So we're lifting it up and just folding it in half. And then with these two flaps, we'll just push those towards the left hand side. flatten out our design, pressing down firmly on all of the creases. So next we'll lift this flap that's in the middle and we'll just fold it off to the right hand side for now. We'll take our left edge, we'll fold it down, just using that existing center line here as a guide for the fold. Creating a nice firm crease. And then we'll open that up. We're going to open the fold up from the bottom. We're just going to be pushing those creases around the other way. And bringing it back together. Now we'll lift our model up again. It's going to flip it round. Now we'll take this top left hand point, so we're facing it out towards the left, about the same length as this bottom point here. Only roughly though, doesn't matter too much. 
we'll create a crease. We'll open that up and we'll just fold it around the other side as well. Just working on making that crease nice and strong. Then we can open it up. And then we'll open up the fold completely. And we'll just press that in. Now we'll do the same for the point here. I'm just folding that point in only slightly. Then opening that flap up, pushing the point inside and bringing the folds back together just to round off that nose area. And we'll take hold of this bottom left point we have a crease line running along here. I'm going to be bringing this edge along to that crease line and creating a new crease. Then we can flip our model over. We have another flap. We'll fold it forward. And then we're bringing this edge along to the crease line. We're just matching this other leg that's down here. And we'll create a nice firm crease. So on the legs or the flippers, we're now gonna take this first layer. I'm just gonna fold that point up just so it's in line with the rest of the body of our seal. And then we'll flip our model over again. We're doing the same for this side, bringing this bottom point up, creating a nice straight line and creating a crease. And now for one of the final steps, we'll take this bottom right point, facing it up for our tail. And choose whatever length you'd like, putting it upwards, creating a crease. open the fold, open it completely, and we're just flipping it the other way around. Closing up the fold. So then, remaining step, draw a little face on, any other decorations, pull these flippers down, and then you have an origami seal. If you enjoyed the video, have a look at our other origami videos, hit the like button, subscribe to our channel, and hope that you enjoy.